be here. So, have you ever had a secret? Some special news that you just can't share? That's been what it's like for us at HP and 3D Print. People ask, what are you up to? We don't say anything until today. We are so excited and we're so looking forward to talk to you about the innovation that we've been doing. So the next 15 minutes, I'm going to talk about what we've been up to since October 2014. I will share the news of the day. I'll talk about the products, solutions, and partners that we're announcing. I will give you a sneak peek into the future because it's incredible to see what is possible when you print at the box level. Now before I go any further, I want to call your attention to the screen. That blue, that's the HP Voxel. We are a 3D voxel printing technology, and it really is our magic ingredient. And we want to make the voxel cool. Now, the question we ask ourselves getting into 3D is how do we drive significant market growth? How do we make the pie bigger? Bigger for everybody? And the answer is we want to move the industry from prototyping to production. Or to say it differently, we want to manufacture it 3D. Now 3D has an amazing potential. There's been certainly some hype, but the technology limits the possibility. And that's why we need innovation. Now back on October 2014, we announced Malta Jet Fusion, a voxel level 3D printing technology. And we said it would do four things. First, be up to 10 times faster than any other 3D printing technology. Second, that we would deliver high quality. We define high quality as a combination of precision and strength. Third, we deliver low cost. When we say low cost, we think from a printer standpoint, we think about that relationship between the price point of the printer and the performance. And we also think about the cost of the part produced. And then finally, we announced we are going to be an open platform. That we said we want multi-jet fusion to be a platform for the world to innovate on top of. Now, all this has been driven by our North Star. And our North Star is we want to change how the world designs and manufactures parts. Or, we want to also lead that next industrial revolution. To you designers and engineers, captains of industry, and leaders of thought, anyone whose ambitions have ever exceeded what was possible. This is your moment, your rewrite history, the world is not flat moment. Every facet of how you design and manufacture is about to be reinvented, and it all starts here, with the smallest of building blocks, the mighty HP Voxel. You and it are about to change the world by advancing radical prototyping, accelerating manufacturing, and taking precision and strength to unparalleled heights. From today forward, the 3D printer is a factory for thought, where the things we make will make us smarter, better, more human. What a future we'll create with new materials and embedded intelligence. Together, we'll bring extraordinary to the everyday and reality to dreams light years away. Welcome to the age of digital production, on demand, a world without waste, without inventory, without warehouses. Meet the first HP Jet Fusion 3D printers, the digital furnaces of the next industrial revolution. Join us as we engineer the never before voxel by voxel. HP Multi Jet Fusion. Keep reinventing. So imagine that compelling future. Imagine just in time production. Imagine mass customization of design. Imagine shipping electrons around the world versus products. And imagine voxel level 3D printing, opening up new design possibilities. But again, it's a vision. 
and vision needs innovation. So today, we're announcing our next step in our journey to redefine the industry. We're announcing the HP Jet Fusion 3D Printing Solution. It's going to be the world's first production-ready 3D printing system. Tapping the potential of the smallest things has always led to giant leaps for humankind. So when we set out to reinvent 3D printing, we began at the molecular level with the smallest of building blocks, the mighty HP Voxel, which led us to this, a leap beyond all the current limitations of 3D printing. Meet the HP Jet Fusion 3D Printing Solution. From this day forward, you will be able to reinvent the way you prototype and manufacture by creating consistently high quality and fully functional parts up to 10 times faster at the lowest cost. Continuous printing and fast cooling processes allow more production in the same day. From design to part, HP Jet Fusion 3D Printing delivers an end-to-end -end solution that scales with your business. And the HP Multi Jet Fusion Open Platform gives you access to a wider range of future materials and applications. Start reinventing the way you prototype and manufacture Voxel by Voxel. HP Jet Fusion 3D Printing. Keep reinventing. So we're announcing two new 3D printers. First, the HP Jet Fusion 3D 3200. Great for high performance prototyping, delivering high quality parts with low cost of operation. We're also announcing the HP Jet Fusion 3D 4200. Now, again, great for high performance prototyping, but allows the transition to short run manufacturing. And it will have the lowest operating costs in the industry, or you could say the lowest part costs in the industry. But why? Why can we do this? Why is this possible with multi-jet fusion? Okay, I am going to geek out a little bit here. Okay, I want to geek out. Okay, we are printing at a 21 micron voxel resolution. That means every 21 micron, we're putting down an agent that's determining what's happening at that voxel. But we also print over 340 million voxels every second. So that combination of resolution and 340 million gives us quality and speed. Now, why can we do this? We're leveraging over 30 years of inkjet leadership. It's the assets that we have that we can leverage, but more importantly, it's the knowledge. It's the people who understand how to put together complex chemistries, materials, reliable systems, and systems that can be serviced. Now, that's a great printer, but it also is about delivering an end-to-end -end solution. So we also are, are introducing software that allows you to robustly prep the print job, manage the workflow, and we will support multiple formats, though we definitely are an advocate of 3D, 3MF for the industry. And we're introducing an innovative 3D processing station. It allows you to set up your print job in a clean environment, allows you to post-process your print job in a clean environment. It allows for continuous operation to maximize productivity, and it has fast cooling for rapid time to part. So I said a lot, a lot in there quickly. To summarize, what we have here is we're able to deliver superior functional parts up to 10 times faster at half the cost. And I'm going to come back and talk about half the cost here in a moment. But before I do that, I want to talk about the product positioning. So what you see up here is a chart. On the y-axis is price, 100,000 to 500,000. And on the x-axis, you see speed. And what you can see is the price performance position of Jet Fusion relative to the other solutions in the marketplace today. Clearly a disruptive position. Let me talk a little bit about our development model, how we got here. Now, we're new to 3D. 
and we had a lot to learn, and we still have a lot to learn. So what we did is our 2014 announcement allowed us to say to the world, hey, we got this great technology. We need to engage. We need to partner. And so what happened is we found partners. And what we found were partners who are really out there leading their, their area in terms of taking advantage of 3D. It's an impressive list. And the model we had in place was they came into our lab. They shared their desires, what they were hoping to get done with 3D printing. They also shared their pain points. And in our labs, they were side by side testing parts as we produced them. And in many cases, they sent their operators into our environments to run our machines. And this allowed us to learn about what it takes to put a solution together. But they had one thing in common, one thing in common. When you asked them what they wanted to do, they wanted to transform their business. They wanted to use 3D to transform their business. And when you talk about transforming your business, you're going to get into talking about the cost of parts. So let's talk about that. I said half the cost. So what? What does that mean? How do I get a sense of that? If you're going to put something into production, North Star, we want to get in production, there's two factors to consider. First, the part. Does your part meet the form, fit, and functionality? OK, it does that. Second, the cost. Is it affordable to print it? And we have this notion of a break-even. How many digital parts can you produce to where it gets more expensive than the traditional manufacturing technique? It's a very complicated sort of relationship, though the tools, we have tools that can uh, estimate that. But let me give you two examples. First, from our Jet Fusion printer and our 3D processing station. It turns out almost half the custom plastic parts are going to be printed by multi-jet fusion. So it's a printer that's printing itself. But it's a very interesting story how we got there. When we started, we said, like, yeah, let's print some parts and put it on our printer, because that would be kind of cool to demonstrate to the world. But when we got into it and we started evaluating, we learned it actually made economic sense, economic sense for us to actually ship almost half the parts to 3D printing. We would have never known that, but that's what we discovered. And let me give you a, a second example, this little gear, right? About one and a half inch in diameter. If you want to produce this gear, you might print. If you need one, you would print it, if, assuming you can get the quality. But how many can you print cost-effectively? Turns out, with multi-jet fusion, you can print over 55,000 gears, and you'll save money versus cutting a mold and molding it. And that doesn't take into account turnaround time or inventory. So that's what happens when you get half the cost, how you can start transforming production. Let me talk about the open platform. Again, if you're in production, going into production, you need thousands of materials available. And we looked at that and we said, how is that going to be possible? And we said, the only way to solve this, we got to go open. We're going to create an open platform, or you can think about it, we're going to create a material app store. And so how it works. You kind of know how app stores work. Material partners or third parties, they'll be able to come and develop materials on our platform today with us. In the future, we'll have a development kit that they'll be able to do this independently. Then they set the price. They set the value proposition. HP, we certify for safety and reliability. And then the customer, the customer, when they go to buy materials, they'll see HP branded materials. They'll see third party branded material, all available to them. We have a revenue share model in place, which works for the material providers, and it works for us. And you can see it's an impressive list of companies have committed to develop materials from multi-jet fusion under their brand. And I think five years from now, this is probably going to be one of the biggest innovations being announced today, allowing the industry to really innovate. OK, I said I'd give a sneak peek into the future. Talk about the HP Voxel. Show some possibilities. Now, be very clear, this is not the first product. But we're going out sharing to get the industry thinking about what could be done. Now, the first thing I want to say for people here at the show, it's a must-see. Go see the HP Voxel Lab. We are sharing use cases based on actually parts that we're producing in the lab. But I had to pick one to share. And so I'm going to go back to the chain link. So when we announced in 2014, 
Multi-jet fusion, we actually printed this chain link and lifted the car to show the strength of the material. So now we have a new chain link that we're printing. A little smaller. But now when we printed this chain link, what we did is we actually, as we print it, used the agents and at certain voxels to actually print a conductor, electronics. And so what you have here in this chain link is embedded circuitry. And what this lets you do is now when you go and lift, you can actually see real time the stress strain of what's happening on that chain link. And this is really, thank you. And the significance of this is, think about the Internet of Things. It's about connecting products. Now you're connecting components. So 3D printing at the voxel level, it's really amazing, and you have to see it to believe it. So let me wrap it up. We are announcing some really innovative products, solutions, and partners today. All driven by our North Star. Our North Star is how do we go from prototyping to production. We're embracing an open platform because we really believe it's the key to innovation in the industry. And together, together, we're going to be able to lead the next industrial revolution. Please stop by the booth today. Thank you very much for your time.